Oops, oops, sorry. Coming through. Coming through. Right out. Here you go. Welcome, friends and family, to the 25th anniversary of the union and marriage of Kathy and David Marshall. Naperville has been connected to these two since the beginning of the union on June 18, 1988. The church they were married at was, was our very own St. Peter and Paul Cathedral, and on the spot which we all stand has been a picturesque spot for where many newlyweds captured memories on film, Kathy and David included. From throughout the quarter century that they spent together, which probably makes a lot of you right, feel really old right now, they have lost two children who, have, who most of you have grown, seen to grow into the young adults you see today. As some of you may or may not know, I am Alex Marshall, the son and first child of these two people. My, my younger sister and second, and second child of Kathy and David, Samantha, will read her piece shortly, but we want to start off strong, so I'm going first. <laughs> if there's one thing that Kathy and David have that's just as strong as a love for each other, it's a love that they have for their children. Without the wisdom and virtues that they've bestowed upon them for the 20 or so years they've been living, their paths would have been radically changed and more than likely for the worse. Like all relationships, there have been trials and tribulations, from the usual petty squabbles to the spending nearly half a year um, half a year spending a year and a half the world apart. But through their occupations and resolve, as well as the magic of Skype, so their bond has only remained strong and continued to last for 25 years, as I expected it to for another 25. Now what we've all been waiting for. <laughs> we are gathered here today with Kathy and David as they exchange their vows of their everlasting love. For the past 25 years, Kathy and David have truly proven how to make a marriage last. To love another person, one must be willing to accept not only their strong points, but also their weakest ones with equal measure of understanding and respect. A marriage goes way beyond two people that are married. A key aspect of a good marriage is a strong bond of friendship, love, and trust that Kathy and David have truly exemplified through their first 25 years of marriage. At this time, Kathy and David have prepared vows that they would like to marry each other. Do you want to go first? I'll go first. Okay. <laughs> doesn't differ too greatly from your own. <laughs> well, we all know, all know yeah, she's you promise. <laughs> There's a chance. I might start getting old. And I'll need someone to take care of me. I'm sick, and I don't know what the hell I'm doing. So you promise to take care of me. In sickness and sickness. Let's table that. <laughs> of course I do. Do you, Kathy, promise? to put up with my goofy. I will. And you promise to continue to be my anchor and the person, the one person that I can't live without. David, do you take Kathy to be your wife, to have and to hold from this day forward, for the better or for worse, for rich or for poor, in sickness and in health, in love and to cherish till death do you part. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> and Kathy, do you take David to be your husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better or for worse, for richer or for poor, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish, till death do you part? I would. Then by the slightest bit of power invested in me, <laughs> I promise him that you are now still married. <laughs> 